Okay, so over here I have my like pile of just random leotards. These are like basically all my leotards that I have. I feel like I have one or two that were like hiding, but I don't know, might not be. This might be all of them. So um, I can tell you definitively that I have never spent more than probably $20 on a leotard. Um, there are leotards out there if you want to buy them that are like $100, $200, probably even up to like $400. But I personally, if I'm gonna spend $400, I'm gonna buy like something that is not a leotard. Um, and so I get most of my leotards from Amazon, Discount Dance, and um, the other place, uh, Dance Wear Solutions. And um, they have a really good selection of leotards. And when you get them on sale, you can get them as low as like probably $10 for a leotard. Um, and so that's where I got most of these. I think a few of them I got from like little dance boutiques, but for the most part, I just get them from Amazon Discount Dance and um, Dance Wear Solutions. So first I'm going to be going into like my black leotards and these are ones that I mostly only wear for ballet because we're supposed to wear black leotards for ballet. So the first one is this one and this is a Capizio leotard and I like this one. It's super, super cute. This is a size um, small and what it has is it's just like a basic um, normal cut leotard. It just has like these kind of bottoms. Um, and then it has these two straps and the straps in the back, I don't know if you can see it, I'll try and like hold it up for you, but yeah, the straps kind of like crisscross in the back and it's super cute. It looks um, really cute on and this is one of my favorite leotards. It's cotton and, um, it's very like snug to the body, which I like. It's not kind of like loose and floppy. Most of my leotards are pretty snug, although some of them are a little like looser in places, but, um, different leotards for different things. So this one, um... And this one's Capizio, and I probably got it from, like, um, Discount Dance. This one is another, um, cotton leotard. And this one is actually I got from Amazon. So it's really, really cute. It has the little, like, neck thing, because it is a high neck leotard. And on the neck thing, there's, like, this little clasp. And this is how you hook it. Um, on the front, it has this little panel of floral mesh. And um, I really like it because it looks really pretty on the body. And then on the back, it just has this super low back. It's like mostly cut out. Um, and then it has the normal bottoms of the leotard. But yeah, this one is really, really cute. And I like it a lot. And I think this one was only like $15 off Amazon. So that is a really good deal. And then next, I'm going to talk about this one. And this is one that I got from Discount Dance. And this is a um, tank top leotard. It has... Um, I think these are called like princess seams or like princess hems or something. I don't know. And then it has this little like crunched up part in the middle. And I like this leotard because it really flatters any body type um, and it makes you look really thin and um, it looks really good with a skirt. And then um, it has the same cut bottoms as every leotard does. I'm not going to keep saying that because literally every leotard I have has that same kind of bottom. But you can get leotards that have kind of like a boy, boy short cut bottom. But I don't really like those leotards. Like I can just throw a pair of shorts on. It's not that big of a deal. But yeah, this one and it just has a plain back. And this one is really comfortable and really basic and traditional. And then a few more black ones. I have this one. And this is a turtleneck leotard and um it zips all the way up around the neck so it's all one piece and um this one i got because they kind of made our rules about leotards a little bit stricter this year just because um they want us to be really modest in dance because i am part of a christian dance company and it has a zipper for the closure in the back which is really nice because you can just zip the whole thing up and this is like a spandex material so it's kind of like stretchy and um, it's good for my more up-tempo classes like jazz and contemporary where I sweat because it keeps me cool and keeps the moisture, um, like makes the moisture evaporate from my sweat, which is really gross. I just realized that. So, um, don't think about that. And then the next leap and final black leotard that I have is, um, this one, if I can get it hooked. And okay, so this one's a little bit difficult to hold up and to like show, um, not on the body. Um, it's basically like a plain spandex leotard for the most part um and it just has like basic tape top straps but then it has this portion which is really really cute and what this portion does is it just um clips over the leotard and this part goes around your neck so it has like this nice little lace um floral lace accent on it which is really really cute and i really love this leotard um this one's a little bit loose on me and i think this one is a large i think off of Amazon because Amazon sizes are a little bit different 
This one is a, it's a medium, but um, it's really, really big. And then there's, not really, really big, but like a little bit big. And then the previous ones, the turtleneck one, this is a small, I'm pretty sure. And then this one's a small as well. The other Amazon one was a large, and this one was is like pretty fitted on me. It's, even though it's a large, which is kind of strange, the size is, oh no, it's a medium. I got them both medium, but it's a little bit more fitted, and these are from the same company. These two with the floral lace are from the same company, but the medium on the spandex one was fit me kind of loose, and then the medium on the cotton one fit me kind of a little bit tighter, just so, um, you know, like if you're ordering from Amazon, they're not all going to be the same size, just because the medium fits you in one doesn't mean it's going to fit you in another style. So then next, moving on to um, other leotards. I have this one which is blue and this is a really fun leotard. I like to wear this with a pair of yoga pants I have that have pink and purple um, and blue flowers on it. It's just a basic like tank top leotard. It kind of comes, it's more like a scoop neck and this is a medium and it is a capizio. And yeah, it's just a basic blue leotard because you know we need basic blue leotards sometimes. And then last leotard for this video is this leotard and this is just like a green Camisole leotard. I don't want to say green because green most of people think is like really bright. It's kind of like an olive and this is from Motion Wear. I got this at like a little dance boutique um, near me and this is a medium. It's just like has kind of a low um, back like a V cut back and um, yeah it's green and it's it's I guess emerald and I like this one because it brings out my eyes and it's so comfortable like y'all this is such a comfortable leotard. It's also like spandexy so it makes it super stretchy and I really like it. So then that is it for leotards. I probably talked way too fast. But that is okay. So then the bottoms that I wear most often are just sh shorts or a skirt. Sometimes I'll steal this one skirt that my sister has. Not very often um, but occasionally I do. So then I have these shorts and these are a body wrappers short and these are a large. I'm pretty sure they are a kids large not an adult large. Um, that's what I'm guessing and they are spandex shorts and they're kind of short um, they're what I wear for jazz mostly um, I also wear them for contemporary sometimes but not all the time sometimes I just wear like a plain leotard and tights um, and yeah they're really comfortable I really like them I've had them for like forever and they are not in like any bad shape at all so that's pretty nice and then the next thing I have and final thing that I have actually is this revolution dance skirt basically it's just like a wrap skirt um, goes around your waist and just kind of like ties um, it goes through like a whole I'll probably show you like how it looks when you actually have it on um, for a demonstration but it's just like chiffon and it's kind of short but I kind of like that because it doesn't inhibit your range of motion at all by having like a super long skirt and um, yeah it's just from revolution dance wear it's a size adult small medium in case you were wondering. I'm not going to show you my tights because um, that would be weird because tights are just like basic tights. They're the same whether, wherever you get them. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and make sure to comment down below um, maybe your favorite styles of leotards, maybe some brands that I didn't mention in this video that you really like of dance wear because I love hearing leotard and recommendations. Um, if you're a dancer, comment if you have any of these products or maybe other products that you of different types of content. I also post vlogs and cool things I do like from vacations and whatnot. Um, and yeah, that's about it. So thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye!